Hey, it's John Siskovich, and if you're going to process broiler soon, you need to do yourself a favor and stop feeding them 24 hours before you process. I'll explain why in just one second. So I hear on a muggy morning in August, uh, these broilers, this is their last day in existence. They are going to their end very early tomorrow morning. Uh, they're getting their last move along the pasture right now. And, you know, for their processor, recommended this, not only recommend, but kind of demanded it. And I've processed a lot of my own birds on farm before. I need the USDA stamp to get into some of the markets that I need to get into, like selling at the farmer's market. So I ship them out. But if you're processing yourself, or if you're bringing it to a butcher, either way, you want to restrict feed for those last 24 hours. And why you do that is because their crop gets full of feed, and when you're processing a bird, you're pulling that crop from the inside down through the back to get a little graphic here. And uh, when you're dealing with the intestines and stuff, you don't want poop in there. You want their system to be flushed out and clean so that it's a cleaner process when they're, you know, butchering, slaughtering the birds and you don't get poop and it's easier to pull that crop out. The whole thing goes a lot quicker and a lot smoother if you do that. If you're restricting feed on those last 24 hours, highly recommended that you give them plenty of fresh water. Lots of water to drink. You wanna flush their system out. You wanna keep them hydrated. That's gonna stress them just a little bit being uh, restricted on their feed, I would imagine. <clears throat> Although I don't, I'm not, you know, don't have the science to back it up, but they're gonna be a little bit hungry by the time they're processed, but that process will go a lot better if you've restricted their feed. Um, hope that tip helps. If you have any further questions on chicken processing, you can leave it in the comment section below. I did do some processing on farm. I'm editing those videos and I'll have them up at some point. Uh, so if you want videos on that, you'll have to subscribe to the YouTube channel. And otherwise, yeah, have a nice day and I'll see you, uh, see you out in the field.